in about four hours' time here in the eastern United States, it'll be 12 a.m. on January the 1st, 2024, marking the beginning of the new year. And it'll also mark the end of 2023, which has been an extremely eventful life for me and everyone else in the world, probably. It's been a quite crazy year, for better or for worse. And I've decided to do my last ever video of the year here on Airsoft Center. Staying with the tradition that I did at the end of 2022 when I filmed my last video on Airsoft Center as well. And the reason that I keep doing this, and that Airsoft Center is so influential to my channel overall, is actually something that not a lot of people probably understand. Now, if you go to my channel page, the home page of my YouTube channel, and you sort by oldest videos first, and you look at like the first 10 to 15 videos that I made, they were all terrible. They all flopped. And I was honestly, because I have many failed YouTube channels in the past, so I was honestly just ready to give up and not post anymore. But then one day, I found this game. This small, like, few hundred player game called Airsoft Center. And I decided to film a video on it. And that video got me to 10 subscribers. And it got a few hundred views, which was insane at the time, because I was struggling to get past 5. And most of those 5 were people that I already knew. And this was the f first time that I got 10 subscribers on this channel, of course. And it was also the first time that I got a video over 100 views. And then I made another video on Airsoft Center. And it turned out to be my most popular ever gaming video and i believe it was called airsoft center my favorite roblox airsoft game you can see it but if you sort by popular on my page and basically what happened is airsoft center and the videos that i made on it pretty much saved my channel and saved me from giving up on it and even though i play many more games than airsoft center today the thing that ultimately guided me to this and allowed me to have a more active channel and gave me the ability to play other games will always have been Airsoft Center because it's the first video that I made and the first series of videos actually that I made that really took off and sprung my channel forward and if if you look back at July of 2022 I know we're talking about 2023 here but July of 2022 was a very it was the most crazy time in the history of my channel because I gained like 200 subscribers within one month which isn't crazy for some but it was crazy for me and that still to this day was my most successful month and it was all because of Airsoft Center and in 2023 I didn't really play Airsoft Center that much until I just because I had basically quit making videos for months if you look from June of 2023 up until October, I posted literally zero, because I'd just given up for some reason, which I will not probably get into, but uh, yeah, I just didn't want to make videos anymore, didn't feel like it, and come November, I wanted to get back into it, and I just thought to myself, what better way to get back into it than to um, start posting more Airsoft content on Roblox, because that's what, that's what started my growth in the first place so it might just restart it as well and to be honest it did i posted a video about the airsoft center 2.0 update in just november so like a month ago and that got like over 400 views and that was just that was very motivational because i thought that my channel had just died and there was no way to recover it but me making that video is what made me realize that this channel can come back. And that was another instance of Airsoft Center and its community saving me, in a way. Saving my channel. Oh, damn. Look at that guy. But, yeah, so it's just another example of me being, my channel being saved by Airsoft Center, you know? So that's why I will always be, oh, hey, 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 I'm talking to you. So that's why on some level, I will always be grateful to the Airsoft Center community, as well as the staff and the dev... Well, not to hate on the Discord staff, but I don't really know most of the moderators. But I mean, when I say the staff, I mean the devs. Most notably, um, Fan, not FanboxYT is his name. And also, 
the lead dev who I know as Tank, but I don't know if he's changed his preferred name by now, but he's Tank. <laughs> I think his name is like Infern009 or something along those lines on Roblox. He's the lead developer. So these two have been very helpful and kind to me throughout my journey of being on YouTube. And that is another reason why I'm grateful to the Airsoft Center team and its community. So yes. And I don't really know if there's much else to say, to be honest. Except that despite me going away from YouTube for several months during 2023, just this last November and December period, which has been two months, has made me realize that I, I never should have left. And it's also made me realize that my channel was never really dead. It was just on some level waiting for me to come back when I was ready. And I'm just very inspired and motivated by all the uh, growth that I've been getting in this last month. Because I, as I said, I honestly thought it, I was stagnant forever. But no, it just turns out you have to post and then you get views, <laughs> which is funny enough. And in the next year, I'm going to try to make better videos, make more videos more consistently, and just continue with the mentality that I've been having this past few months, which is that, um, I mean, I, I was trying to think of something inspirational there, but really it's just fun making YouTube videos and posting them and seeing what people think. But anyway, yeah, I'm going to continue forward, and if whoever's coming along for the journey, thank you for being here. And to those who have been here, for, it's going to be two years now. Two years of Dr. Save. Can you imagine that? This coming March or April, it's going to be two full years. It's nearly two years now, but not just yet. And it will be two years of save. Just think of that. Two years. In those two years, what have we done? We've gotten to 600 plus subscribers, which is crazy. This is the biggest channel that I've ever had in my history of having channels. And I know 600 subscribers isn't a lot too many. But to me, it is a nice little community here. <laughs> and, I mean, 600 people went to my middle school, dude, and it was packed. So, I mean, 600, that's crazy. Like, that's a thats a small militia right there. If we get together, we can <laughs> cause some harm to society. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Bro, bro, bro. Okay. But, yes, there's not really much else I have to say here. Other than thank you to those who view my videos, whether it be long form like this, gaming, shorts, whatever it be, thank you. I don't know why shorts viewer would be on here. And thank you to the subscribers, the viewers, the commenters especially, and to the Airsoft Center dev team as well for kind of carrying, I don't, yeah, carrying my channel for the last year. <laughs> and so, <laughs> Well, although 2023 might not have been the most active year for my channel, I hope to take this last few months as inspiration into 2024 and continue on the path that I'm going down. So thank you to everyone, and I'd just like to say farewell to 2023. I'll see you all in the new year.